Wagwam beautiful people welcome back to my channel this is Katashi and today I'll be showing you how to make teriyaki chicken without honey but we will be using Eve guava jelly let's get into it so over here I've already prepped the chicken bits you can use the part of the chicken that you want to but I'm choosing to use breast today so we are going to go in with a little bit of jerk seasoning Not a lot, just a little because you don't want to over season the chicken because the because the soya sauce already has you know, a lot of salt so we don't want to over season the chicken. So now we're going to give this a little rubbing, rubbing it up like this. So now we're going to go in a, with about a tablespoon of cornstarch because we want to give the chicken a li little extra crisps to it, okay? And we're going to rub that in also. Coat the chicken a bit. After we have rubbed in the cornstarch and the jerk seasoning, we're just going to give this about 10 minutes to marinate while we head over to making our sauce. So now we're going to use our soya sauce. So the exact amount of ingredients that I'm using today will be down in the description. So not to worry. So we're going to add our soya sauce. Sugar. garlic, scallion, and some ginger. So now we're going to add white vinegar, a small cup of water, And our guava jelly and now we're going to give that a little mix uh oh it's okay to spill still stirring until all the guava jelly comes out Still a little couple of pieces in there, but that's okay. Alright, so now we're going to push this to the side. So now I will be adding our chicken breast to the pot. Don't have to add everything at once. Have to eat space in there so that we can easily turn the chicken over. So we're going to give each side of the chicken 10 minutes to get brown and then we're going to flip it over and give it the next 10 minutes. So we'll come back. So we are 10 minutes in and some of our chicken has started to brown. So we're going to get the I'm going to now flip it over and let the other side brown. So I fried off all our chicken and this is the consistent color that we want to get, this golden color. So guys, when you're doing the teriyaki chicken, be sure to use a non-stick pot. It works way better. So now I'm going to pour the sauce in the pot. And now we're going to add our chicken gradually.
know that I've added all the chicken pieces. I'm just give, going to give this a little stir like this. One more pot keep moving. <laughs> That's okay. So now that we've stirred everything together, we're going to give this about 10 to 12 minutes and then come back. You want to continue to, to stir it. So guys, our chicken is coming along very good. So I'll see you in 10. So guys, this is the end product of our teriyaki chicken with guava jelly. And it is ever so glossy, looks so good, tastes so good. So now we're just going to add a little garnish of sesame seed on top. So guys, here's our garnish of sesame seed on our teriyaki chicken. Look at it guys, so wonderful, so wonderful. I'm going to plate this for you so you could see how great it looks. Mm -hmm. 